introduce one guy who is called Raja. <coughs> so again, now we are going to pass the kadogo. So team, how was dinner? Excellent. Very good. Okay. Okay. Had a good appetite? Yes. yes. <laughs> I'm glad to hear that. Once again, congratulations for what you have done today. It was awesome. Uh, I would like to introduce this guy. He's going to join us. So five of us, uh, for nine of you, plus another, our fellow guide from another company with his client. <laughs> uh, we plan going to live here around 12. If we are going to live here around 12, we want to leave it to you to decide. When would you like to wake up, start dressing for summit gear, and then come here to have uh, tea and what? We normally prefer tea, toast, I mean the light food. Right. Okay. Yeah, so 12 o'clock on dot, time to leave. So mm -hmm. I want to hear from you. When yeah. would you like to wake up? Do we have to pack all the everything as no, usual? No, you can leave them <laughs> randomly. Because after back from the summit, we'll have maybe one hour or one hour and a half resting, and then oh. wake up, have lunch, and then continue down okay. to make okay. a Okay, so no bags to do. Okay. Yeah. The dancer stays here? Yes. Okay. 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 Good. So, uh, who can you decide? When would you 11 like 30 maybe? maybe or? 11. 11.30? So, 11.30 is a little short. No, but 11.30 is yes. Wake up. Uh, 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 right? 11.15. Yeah, 15. Yeah, 11.30 here. So 11.30 here is good. Yeah. Okay. Okay, 11.30 at the tent. Yes. Yeah. 10 minutes. Okay, maybe here. You're part of the team now. Question, Lucas. If we live at 11.55, it's better. <laughs> <laughs> Does everyone Does leave at midnight? Eleven fifty-five. Or yeah. forty-five. Very possible. Or forty-five. Yeah. Maybe. To, to avoid too much people. It's it's forty-five. Yeah, it's very possible. I, I believe that uh, there are those who are going to live here around eleven. Okay. Start wow. walking, going to the summit. Okay. For those who are slowest. Okay. Ah, for those who are yeah. slowest. So they're going to be in front of us. Most of the people here are in the summit. Most of the people they're going to live here at midnight. Okay. At midnight. Okay. Yes. So maybe we can take a few. Yes, yes. And then and then then uh, uh, the uh, the slow people leave at 11. So it's not 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 Okay, uh, going to the summit, there are two goals. Mm -hmm. yeah. One, uh, reaching to the top. Yes. yes. Second, <laughs> try to reach <laughs> during the sunrise. Okay. Yes. So, uh, we are going to take you five hours to six hours from here to uh, stellar point yes. in which is going to be a uh, difficult part there are some of part going to be very steep 
some of part is going to be gentle slope. Mm -hmm. uh, the very first part, uh, which is going to be rock party, is from there to, I mean, the very first part which we can see from here, where we can take maybe 45 minutes, then we are going to get to the gentle slope. And then uh, we'll continue all the way up, but uh, uh, I would like to tell you there are some of challenging, like a feeling like uh, uh, freezing is normal. Mm -hmm. You may feel light headache is normal. Dizzy is normal. Be free to let us know as uh, we can, uh, we know how to deal with those kind of challenges. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, because uh, you planned to do it and now you are here, nothing can stop you to make your goal come true. Push yourself as much as you can to do it. Climbing the mountain is not all about how you are physically fit or whatever. It's here. You have to be strong on your mind. Yeah, you may feel weak, but a push. Try to push yourself as much as you can. We know the uh, severe symptoms which we can advise you to go down. But uh, let us know. Be free to let us know whenever you feel. And we will be able to assist in you whenever assisting is needed by carrying your backpack or whatever. We will have the short breaks, but a very quick break. Maybe you have to pee or you want to drink or less than five minutes or four minutes, then we continue. Because stay a long break, you're gonna get in freezing. Yeah. And uh, the very, Yes. Because you said the second goal is to see the sunrise, but I might be slow and I don't want to keep anybody from Doesn't seeing it. Doesn't matter. So they, we can break in different group? Yeah. Yeah, but uh, it will be better if we're going to get all of you yeah. at the same time. Yeah, but I don't want to slow. You are slowest, but uh, we know how we used to walking on the sunny night. The pace you are walking or you have walking, the very similar as the pace we are going to walk in during the summit night. Yeah, so don't be afraid about your pace. Yeah. Once you get above 5,000 meters, uh, your water bottle can be freezing. Uh, the kind of water bottle like this one, uh, we advise after feeling your water, you can put it upside down because the water normally starts freezing on the top. So you can be able to drink in the water. For those who are using uh, camelback, mm -hmm. after drinking, blow the air to push the water, go back to the inside, yeah. Mm -hmm. As your tube cannot be freezing and you can be able to drinking during the time when you need it to drink. We, we uh, can get this kind of bottle in the... In the backpack. Yes. Backpack. Yeah. Or, or if you have wear clean socks, yeah. uh, you can put, put on the socks. Yeah, yeah. clean socks. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. Clean socks for sale? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it can help. Hot water? Hot water? Yeah. Does that work? I don't know what kind of bottle. Yeah, this one's good oh, because the, it, it, can it, stay it, for stay, it stays very, very hot okay. for eight hours. Okay. So I, I know that it doesn't freeze because so, if it's, and I'm going to put half hot water, uh, cold water. Our aim is that for those who are using the hard plastic water bottle because they can be freezing, so they can go with those ideas. 
put on the clean socks, but on, when you are going to put on your backpack, put upside down. Yeah, uh, we are going to take this flask bottle with a ginger. But I want to know from you, would you like to uh, use sugar or only dry ginger? Sugar or oh, a little bit? So maybe one only hot water without ginger and the two with ginger? Yes. Okay. <coughs> uh, for dressing, I just want to give some idea. Yeah. I know that uh, our body are different. <laughs> they are react in different way when it comes for freezing. Myself, I'm usually used to wear three long underwear plus three. this one. Yes. Three. Three yes. plus this one. Yes. Okay. Three. Yes. <laughs> well, <okay>. Myself. <laughs> you are used to no, no, living in a cold know. country, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> you can wonder why. <laughs> yeah, but uh, also on top, I usually wear uh, three fleeces mm -hmm. with down jacket yeah. and... Uh, windbreaker. Uh, windbreaker and another one down jacket, I'm going to take it. On my bag, in case when I'm going to feel much cold, I'm going to add it. Uh, remember that uh, when you get about 5,000 meters, it's very, very cold, particularly around the four up to around the six. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> so better to leave with the most and take off if we need to? Yes. Okay. Uh, or take the most? Yeah. I yeah. hope everyone has been. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone has uh, balaclava because sometimes can be wind. Uh, like this or uh, like thicker. Yeah. Like in Kagul. So, five to six hours to Stella Point, another one hour from Stella Point to Uru Peak. And when we get there, we don't spend much time there. Only take picture, maybe uh, ten minutes, and then start come back. We are going to take three hours from there back here. So when we come back here, maybe we'll have, we'll see at what time we're going to back here, come back here. We can have one hour or one hour and a half resting and then wake up, have lunch, and then continue down four hours from here to make a camp okay. by walking downhill. And we get to that camp? Where no. Camp? No. No. Yes. Okay. Mweka camp elevation there is 3,100 meters <laughs> of altitude. Very close to... to the trees? Yes. One question. Yeah. Can we touch the snow? You can touch. <laughs> <laughs> and do you think uh, camera and light phone work? For, uh, uh, yeah. Very good question. Uh, try to protect your camera because you may reach in there and uh, uh, battery is dead. Doesn't work. So protect your camera as well as your phone with a uh, Another socks? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Another socks? I, 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 I went from 20 euro to 50 euro. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe about the battery? No, you may put your battery just in the battery inside. inside. Yeah. 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 So once yeah. you want to use it, just put it on. Yeah. And you can turn off. And turn it off. Yeah. When yeah. you start, you turn off. When you reach there, you turn off. Yeah, you're welcome for questions. Is, it, is the path only one path, or is this multiple paths so you can pass people if they're slow? Or oh, it's going to be stop? different. There are some of parties going to be huge, so people they can pass away. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's physically difficult, but not technical? Not technical. Yeah. Okay. Is only this part here that is 
almost high. After that, flat, then we can start like a zigzag. Yeah. Harder than any path we have done before? No. So no similar rock, to? Yeah, no rock climbing. Okay. Only just this walk. Okay. No, no arrogant yeah. kiss. Yes, yes. Also, stick is necessary while you come down. Coming down, yeah. yes. How many bottles uh, we take of uh, At least uh, three liters per person. Okay. Yeah. Two we, to three liters. Do we fill tonight each. before we go to bed or you fill tomorrow morning? Mm. We feel at the before, at go the before to go to bed. Yeah, it's better. Before to go to bed. Yeah. Okay. You are ready for it. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. <laughs> 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 